We gather to remember and to celebrate the lives of those firefighters who have enriched their communities with their selfless service. But as we all know, the sacrifices and heroism of firefighters didn't begin in 1981. There are many firefighters who died while serving their communities before 1981 who deserve recognition. I think this, re remember the people that were there before you did the same job that you're doing today and wanted to be remembered. And I think it's a very, very important thing that we remember who we were and where we come from. It means so much to me, and I guess to people like me that have lost somebody so close to them. I miss him, but I'm so glad that I have the honor of coming here to see what he would have loved to have seen. Chief Seaman, my father. They're honoring their grandfather. While memories may have faded, that on this day and in this place, you've made the effort to recognize all then a hero comes along. This is my father, George Connor, um, a.k.a. Buddy Connor from Bloomfield, New Jersey. He's a father of nine. A strong piece of evidence of lives well lived and taken too soon. So when you feel like hope is gone, look inside you and be strong. I haven't cried for him in a long time. But it feels good. It's a beautiful place. It's a beautiful ceremony. And you'll finally see the truth that a 